Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome back to another YouTube video. Sorry for no uploads, just getting a few things together and all that good stuff. But I have to cover some news and everything. And I haven't covered Spider Man 2 really since the game dropped. And there's really no reason for it. It's just typically just for, you know, content on my channel, just making uh, cautious decisions about what games I post. But Spider Man 2, I have at least 200 hours in this game. <laughs> um, so, yeah, I, I definitely play this game a lot. I'm I play this game quite a bit. And I make Spider Man clips on TikTok as well as my Instagram. So, you guys can follow me on that. So, yeah, I'm not absent when it comes to making content with it. It's just not on YouTube. Um, with that being said, I just wanted to use this time since the new game plus is dropping tomorrow with a lot of new features that i'll be reading off here soon started getting to that and then i'll be getting into some of the discourse around spider-man 2 um yeah people have been crapping on this game since december of the uh game awards and i don't understand why so we get into all that now so the new patch is dropping tomorrow march 7th you guys don't know with new game plus finally dropping with Fly suit for PETA, the fresh suit for Miles, 10 photo mode stickers, and two photo mode frames. I mean, I don't know these are not really excited things, but these are just little tidbits. Alongside with that, we're going to be getting tendril colors where we can swap the tendril colors. You know how you have the Venom suit and they actually keep it white in all instances. It doesn't really change the color. Kind of weird. It should have been base game, but hey, we're getting it. And we're also getting the ability to change weather. This is something that was, sh again, should have been base game and it should have been something that they added just at the start we need to be able to change the weather it works for clips it works for content in general and it just just looks cool it just be it just good to have that feature like it's just a basic feature that we should have should have been have now with this feature here i think that it's not just gonna be able to change the time of day but we might be able to change the weather as well as we did in miles morales we were able to not only change the time of day but it, you, you can change it to about if it was snowing raining heavy rain rain light rain fog all that stuff so i think they're adding maybe they might add more uh dynamic weather changes to the game uh so we'll see about that with all that being said, the new Game Plus edition, I hope that it's going to have a little bit more of a story expansion type-esque uh, vibe. I know that some new Game Plus, they add in little extra challenges or little extra things uh, uh, to the story. Not saying they're going to add an entirely, you know, change the story or anything like that, but it's going to be something extra, something new, and something to look forward to for the new Game Plus. I don't want to just play with my character, you know, just play with my character at level 60 over again. I want to be able to kind of... Uh, do a little, a little bit something different. Maybe encounter some things that you couldn't have encountered in the first half of the game when you played it without New Game Plus and stuff like that. So, well, hopefully we get a lot of new features. Uh, the patch seems to be, um, I don't really know the gigabytes or anything like that, but it, it, it's not going to be too lengthy in my opinion. I shouldn't be too big. Uh, but go ahead and check your, you know, check out your updates and all that good stuff tonight. Make sure you have to download it. With all that being said, we have something to talk about in terms of opinions and discourse. Uh, people have kind of been turning their teeth to Spider-Man 2, uh, considering that they guess they quote unquote uh, subpared their uh, awards in game ceremony and the game awards ceremony. And I have to say, you guys are full of BS. I mean, this, the hype around this game was insanity when it was coming out. Um, it was one of the b most anticipated games of 2023 besides Baldur's Gate, Baldur's Gate 3. Um, and for us to turn our backs on it just because you know we praise other games it's kind of weird I'm, I'm, I'm hearing stuff like you know spider-man was mediocre spider-man 2 was just it was bad it was tr or it was trash or the story was mediocre now i will agree that it wasn't as good as the part one the story wise but if you're talking about the game in general the game is much better and it's really it's really no point in going back to the other games it's literally made to fit the the next gen and it, i think this spider-man 2 is what they were leading up to from spider-man 1 and for us to just turn our cheeks on their work and stuff like that again not saying that you can't have your own opinions but people are just giving just broad consensus is regurgit regurgitating things they hear on t twitter talking about stuff like oh y'all should have y'all should have uh had this stuff base game yeah we, we know we should have had some things base game but like I just don't hear any solid criticisms for the game other than this, you know, Miles being the new Spider-Man or whatever. And that to that, I say, again, it's to the writers. It's not up to you. And just other tidbits of just little, oh, you know, the, the story, just Venom. They didn't do anything with Venom, which is asinine because he was done very well. And I felt like they adapted him pretty, pretty cool. And it, we got to play as Venom. They teased the whole game in a game like they tease a whole game section a whole game in a game like we're getting a venom game 
and they put it in Spider-Man. Like, I don't understand. I just, my thing is like, I may not remember all of what was said, but I just remember seeing some stuff that was like, y'all aren't making sense. Y'all aren't really having any solid critiques. Y'all are just, just trying to shit on it because everybody else is. Spider-Man 2 is a great, great, phenomenal game. Is it 10 out of 10? Is it even 9 out of 10? Unfortunately, no. It's an 8 out of 10 game. I really enjoyed the game overall. And for people to just sit here and just turn their backs on it again, just calling it trash and, oh, yeah, this wasn't it. Yeah, no, just not okay. With all that being said, uh, this is just my little tidbit on Spider-Man 2. We have the update dropping tomorrow, so let us all enjoy that update. I will be doing, I guess, like a review for the Spider-Man. So I did a review for Spider-Man 2. I'm going to do a review for the New Game Plus. All that good stuff. going to be playing through it and all that good stuff. So leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new and get us more Spider-Man 2 content. Peace.